Hello again, welcome back to another haul. This one is actually a little special. Maybe it's better this way. And there you go. You can see it better now, but so this is a little bit of a special haul, and do you know why? If you because if you've been watching um since well around this time last year actually is when I kind of restarted the channel kind of rebranded and everything because uh this youtube channel was just for me to upload stuff for like um yeah it was for the dot hack gu community stuff so i was just uploading like just random things and then like um there's also like a, one of the, the or one of the lunar new year things going on so so this is actually a very special haul because the first video i uploaded to kind of like restart the channel was Lupicia and it was Sakura which I will link that first video in the cards above if you want to go check it out and kind of compare how they um, changed the look of the packaging and everything but but yeah so to celebrate the one year for the channel since the you know the rebranding and everything I went to Lupicia to grab what of course Sakura stuff because they got it in they got it in on like a Friday like this past Friday depending on when I upload this because I'm going to try and time it to the the one year but I was like I saw the, the email Friday night and I was like oh they got it I gotta go get it because I know they were gonna like run out the last time of stuff because I waited a little bit too long because I was like well I can't go right away and I was like no this time I'm gonna get it <laughs> I'm gonna get it as soon as possible which was in this case the next day as you probably saw like the, the footage because i tried to take a little bit of video inside the store and stuff this time but i was like oh i'm gonna get it so make sure that it don't run out because <laughs> uh there's something in here for somebody which they'll probably end up seeing this before but that's okay you'll know who it is or you know who you are and you'll know what it is <laughs> that's all right but anyway, in celebration of the one year, our grab, but of course, Sakura tea. And I don't know, maybe I'll make it like a tradition for the channel or something to like try to time the one year anniversary with hopefully the, the PCA Sakura tea because it's actually pretty good, you know, if you've never tried it. And see. There's a bunch. So I'm going to maybe put this on the ground just so it doesn't like block the way. But so the funny thing is, I got charged for like something that wasn't mine because it got mixed up. So they gave me like an extra. They gave me an extra like free sample. <laughs> so this is the one they gave me for accidentally making a boo boo button. So yeah, so when you do buy from the PC, they will usually give you um, a sample or like this, like an individual tea bag, pretty much. Um, I'm going to assume that they do if you buy it from them because I always get something. So, so this one is a sakura bowl, which is supposed to be like the not necessary sakura, but it's supposed to be cherry. It's supposed to be like a cherry black tea. If you never had sakurambo, what's that? And I got, I'm going to butcher this probably. Ratam? 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 I butchered it. I'm so sorry. I don't know how to say it. But I'm not sure what this one is because I don't really remember trying this. Maybe it's a black tea? I mean, it kind of sounds like it could be, but there's that. And there's pickle. Not from Dragon Ball. This is the tea. Piccolo. I've had this before. I can't really remember off the top of my head what kind of tea it is. I don't know if it was green. Um, I feel like it might have been like a low caffeine or something, but I could be wrong. So there's that. And this, this I know. The Sencha Chiran. 
Sencha should usually be like the green tea or like it has a little bit of matcha in there. But it's one of the slightly fancier green teas um, that you'll find because it's like the something to do with like the, the leaves when they pick the leaves and like the area and there's a whole bunch of other stuff that they kind of consider but so that's what the sencha would be. So those are the ones I got for free as a sample. Um, the design side. What should we start with? Hmm. I know, let's we'll start with the one that's kind of ambiguous. <laughs> Aha! So, this is wrapped, which certain ones will come wrapped. And what is in here? This is one of the teas, which I guess I'll say because I'm pretty sure she's just going to see it anyway, so that's okay. But this is one of the um, the sets that comes with like two small tins, and I believe there's five tea bags in each tin, and this one should be the the low caffeine or no caffeine. So it's the I can't remember the name for one of them. Like it's a little hard for me to say, but it's kind of like a I guess it's sort of like a flowery, fruity kind of one. And the other one should be a sakura raibo. Or, right? Am I saying that right? Hopefully I'm saying that wrong. No, no not raibo. Raibos. Raibos? Raibos? Anyway, it's, it is a, just, I think it should be a decaffeinated tea. The raibos, raibos. And then sakura. So it has that, um, like sakura leaves taste to it. So here, yeah, those should be the two that are in here. I mean, it is, if you look at it, it is almost hard to tell. Because it's like, how can you tell? And that, you know, got these numbers saying, I don't know what those number things are. The name. But you can slightly see through the packaging. So I kind of went based off of that. Because the other set, uh, that's like a two set, which I think was like Sakura and Sakura Berry. Um, the packaging is different. And you can kind of tell if you look through it. Like, this would have been a different design underneath. So I was like, okay, this should be it then. Because they do have a display, as you might have seen. So yes, so you got that. You got the Sakura and Berry. I like to get this one individually. And you'll see why. Because I pretty much kind of got like the same things. <laughs> like last year, but I mean, look at that packaging different from last year but I like it it's pretty as you can see it says sakura berry black tea with cherry leaves are scented with sweet strawberry flavor spring limited tea and at the back see how to make it you got the ingredients you got the list of stuff all the stuff everything all the stuff it's the top it's the bottom to the side so this is, as it says, 10 tea bags. So it's 10 of the sakura and berry tea, which is a black tea. So I'm not sure if you could see that. This is black tea. But yeah, I like to get the um I like to get the loose leaf one for the sakura and not the loose leaf. I like to get the tea bags version of the sakura berry because I like the box. Because <laughs> there's normally like even well, even with this um no caffeine no caffeine one they do have a box version like this which is with the 10 tea bags or um you get the tins by itself not like in this set but if you get the tins by itself with the fancier packaging then that is usually loose leaf which is pretty much um you know like the the tea leaves is just all inside there there's no like you know it's not in individual bags or anything like that so you do need like some kind of scoop or something in order to uh, scoop out the appropriate amount of the leaves and then you need the strainer and everything too so it just kind of depends on um, how you drink your tea and you know if you have the right equipment and stuff I guess if you're lazy <laughs> then the tea bag you know is how people will go but 
for me, it just kind of depends on um, what it is, and then I guess how I'm going to drink it. So, yeah, I'll just <clears throat> just grab grab as I go. So this is the matcha um, owl latte, 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 maybe mix in a sakura. It says it says just add milk to this matcha owl latte mixture. Probably saying that wrong. Only get aroma of Japanese cherry blossoms. Let's look at that. So this lasted for quite a while when I got this last time. So there is this is sweetened. This is a sweetened mix um, of matcha. This is sugar, got the powdered green tea, which is like the matcha. Powdered cherry leaf, powdered cherry petals. Ooh. And don't ask me why there's aluminum potassium sulfate in there. I'm gonna assume it's to keep it from not uh, spoiling too fast. <laughs> but yeah, I remember last year this was pretty good. So I was like, oh, I'll get it again. Just add milk. Usually, well, it, the instructions is for like if you're making it hot, but I actually liked it cold. And it still came out good when it was cold. But there's that. It's the matcha. Now I'm keeping everything off to the side, so hopefully this is um this is going to focus. <laughs> Next, we got the Sakura Hoji Cha. Well, it says Hoji, but it's Hoji Cha. Sakura. Oji cha. Oji cha is for the tea pot. And that. This is the back. So, hoji cha is like the roasted uh, green tea. So, it does have a different taste to it. And it says here abundant sa salted cherry leaves are blended into quality hoji cha. So, if it's anything like last year's one, you can tell the sakura, like that salted sakura-ness to it, to the hojicha. At least for me, it was pretty like distinct. Distinct enough for me to tell. It was like, mm, no, this is not just hojicha. And I'm trying to remember, I think the last year I wasn't actually able to get the hojicha in the pouch like this. Because this is one of the 10 tea bag ones. I think I ended up having to get the loose leaf and it wasn't, you know, with packaging, it was just um just in there like the loose leaf will come in like this silver, which uh, I do need to put like the upload the videos for some more of the other Lupecia stuff, but it's like in a little silver pouch that's you suction all the air out, so I guess that way it doesn't spoil as fast, but so I think because I waited too long, I couldn't get the Sakura Hojicha like this. And I think I had to get it in the silver pouch thing. So just like, hmm, because like I wanted the pouch design and stuff. But I mean, it still tasted the same. And it was loose leaf though. But this is tea bag. So that's the difference. But, but yeah, if you don't really care about the packaging, then you can always get everything in like the silver pouch usually. But I care about packaging. Because, <laughs> you know. I'm a designer, so I like packaging colors. Those usually are what, you know, helps me turn if I get something too immediately. Or in the bag. <laughs> they asked if I wanted a small bag. I was like, oh. at first I said no. And then I was like, you know what? Maybe I should. Just at least one. <laughs> I think the last time I actually had more of a, like a sucker to print to it. But yeah, it's okay, whatever. I'm probably gonna put the like the gift in here. It's a little big, but I always put other stuff in there. But yeah, so sometimes they will give you um like a free little bag like this if you want one. Uh, the bag that everything was in earlier though that was not free. That was forty cents. I paid for that because I was like, it's a soccer bag. I want to get it, just like I did with the other one. It's like I want to collect the bags because it's pretty. And again. Designer. The next we have this is a tea bag set. So it has five tea bags in there. And they come like this. So they come like this. So it's like a stack of five of them. I wouldn't to assume that's in here. I mean I guess I could open it, but 
Like, like look at that. And the lady said I can like uh, push this up or something so that it can like pop up. Kind of. <laughs> probably not. Probably not quite. Probably not quite what she meant. But it's like. Hmm. Ah, okay, well, sort of like that. So it's like, ooh, look at that. And I kind of like, wow, this is neat. So this is, let me see. I'll probably just have to open it. But So this has some sakura and some not sakura. I was like, I gotta get the packaging. So let's see, how do we open this? Looks like we fold this and so we go like this and ta-da. Ooh, right. Oh, it looks like we got some information in here. Oh, on the tea. So that's how I guess we know what's in here. Usually there's like a little pamphlet thing or something, you know, like this. But this is just um, just general stuff in Japanese. So we got here to Sakura Sakura Vert. Which is the black tea. Vert is the kunji, the green tea. And then there's that sakura and berry. Um, and the other one in here is going to be La Belle Hip Pop. I'm going to put your own that's it. And this is Momo Vert. Which is, if you don't know, Momo and this is the peach. And the vert is the green tea part. And got some how to on the other side. Let's take it out. Ooh. And I like their um because they also do specific like uh packaging for the tea bags too individually like this. So I like that too. I like to keep it because look at that, it's pretty. So this is the sakura individually. See, so as you can see it's all just stacked on each other. Oh and it does have the information on the tea in the back too. This is the sakura vert. The green tea. There's that chocolate berry. Information. And then they had a stack like this, so let's see. This is the bubble it pop or something. So these so as you can see each of the sakura ones had their own different designs to it. Um, so if there's any other ones that's part of the sakura but is not sakura, you know, like it doesn't have the sakura um, leaves or petals or something in it, then this is like the, um, for lack of better words, like the generic packaging. There's that. And as you can see, this other one, which is the Momo Vert, it's the same design. That's the back. But yeah, so it's like this because it's a little bit off, if not, but yeah, so then this is a good one that they also suggest, which I can see is like you can get as a gift. I want to give somebody because it's like a like a little gift box and it's a neat gift box. So if you know that they're going to like the teas that are in there, you can grab this. And it's nice. You can keep it. It's pretty. Which I'm probably going to individually like um, give these out because we already have the berry, as you saw. We also we also have the sakura and the sakura bird as well. So give that out. And speaking of. The Sakura and the Sakura Vert. But again, I grabbed the premium versions for both. So as you know, I did grab the premium versions last year for these because the difference between the regular ones and these premium ones, besides the pretty packaging, besides the colored tins, there's that. So besides that, the difference is that it has the salted cherry petals. So the they actually have the sakura petals in here. 
You can see it says salted cherry petal, cherry petal or sakura, um, salt, Japanese plum vinegar, some, and a bunch of that stuff again. <laughs> Probably to preserve it, but yeah, so that is the difference between just the regular sakura, sakura vert, and then these premium ones is that it has the petals in it. And I kind of liked it better with the petals. So that's why I went and I grabbed them again. So let's see. Uh, well, I'll try and open this one. Only one of them. And it's not going to peel good. So as I mentioned, these are the tins. So if you don't want to grab the key bag version, which usually would come like this. Um, you can get the tins, which is the loose leaf. So I don't think I opened this actually last time. So this is what it looks like. You get the tin, any of the tins, whether it's like the fancy print or if you just get a regular, regular old tin. Um, I think they all have like some kind of information thing like this. This is what the Sakura Vert one looks like. The Sakura Vert Premium. This is Japanese, this is the English. And this is the tea. So this is the silver pouch I was talking about. If you buy the loose leaf, it comes like this. Silver pouch. Usually if you're buying it by itself, not with the tin, then it'll have, you know, like a label. The front and the back with the information what it is and then you have to peel it open from here peel it or cut it but I, i'm actually able to peel it i think so. so yeah so that's how the loose leaf will come it's not going to just be in here that'd be kind of that'd be kind of bad <laughs> because you never know if this thing might just pop open and there everything goes but if you really wanted to though you could just like open this and then you know shove it into the tin but um, how we were drinking the the ones last year, or the ones that I usually get with the tin, I don't usually take them out and pour it into the tin, because I like to keep the tin, and I don't know if, like, I don't know if sparks will be attracted to that or something. So just to be safe, I don't pour it in there, but you could if you wanted to. And then I just uh, give you, like, another... Or actually, I should give you a good look at both of them. Yeah, there you go. I know when I did this video last year, with the last year's um, like Sakura set, I did not talk. I only put text, so it was a little hard to probably be able to explain everything well. Plus, I just that was my first time trying premium, the the premium teas. So, well, I think even the matcha like latte thing. So I didn't really know too much about it, but now I can kind of explain a little bit more. And kind of show it, but yeah, like oh, I like it. It's worth it because of the. It does make a difference with the with the petals. <laughs> okay, and then oh, let me. I'll put it here. Last but not least, we have the tea bag set with 15 in it. There's one that had like a whole lot more to it, it's like a big, wider box. I debated about that, but I was like, But I'm usually getting all this other stuff, so that's key. I'll just get the small box. But the small box is neat. This little small box is neat, just like the last year's one. But anyway, here's the top. The print. The sides, the back with the information, and here's the bottom. More information. So, let's see. It kind of looks like it could just slip out. Yeah, it can, but we're not going to do it like that. So, just like the key bag set here, it has the sakura. Petals that you can go, hey, and then it's 
Yeah, so it opens the same way. So I was like, oh, that's neat. I think the last year's one, uh, I don't remember if it had like this venti mist at the top, but I think I had to like slide it out and then it was just one giant thing to pull out, but, well, first use the top, the green top. But this year, it's two drawers. It's not just like one whole big thing where the tea bags were set up like this. Just two drawers. So I was like, oh, okay. I like the drawer idea. Uh, I don't I don't know if I want to really pull the whole thing out, but don't fall over. There you go. So here's the little this is the list of all the teas that are in here. You can pause that if you need to. It doesn't seem like there's like 15 tea bags in here, but we will go through it. All right, well, it's coming out <laughs> easier. It apparently is going to be easier. So, as you can see, we got Sakura again. And Sakura Hurt. Sakura Berry. Here. So this, um, Sir Sir? I don't know how to say that, but this is one of the low caffeine or non caffeine teas that comes with the, uh, the set, like this one. But you can also grab a box version of it or they have the tins as well. Well, that's one of them. So that's the one I couldn't think of. And then here's the other one. This is the other low caffeine, non caffeine one, the Sakura Boibos. Boibos, Boibos. These two are going to go to my mom because sometimes she needs the non-caffeine or low-caffeine ones. So that way she can still try to suck with it. Yes, this is going to you. And I see you next time. And this looks like is the Sakura Hojicha. Because I can kind of recognize the Hiragana, the kanji. And then, uh, I don't know how to say this. Nyogiri? Bop. <laughs> I forget exactly what this one is. Or should I just look at the... Where's the paper? Should I just look at the paper? Or should I save that for you, for you guys if you're interested? Because <laughs> there, this is on the website. They have a website. The information is going to be in the description box. So you can check their website and then it should have an explanation usually for all the teas. So okay, you go check out their website. Then you can buy it. <laughs> So that was in the first set of what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Put back to the corner. Okay, that's not too hard to put back in and stuff, so. And we got this. So this is going to be all of the generic um, Sakura packaging, because, you know, Sakura specific teas were already in there but it's the Assam. So this is like the black tea. We got the little one. And then we got Earl Grey. A simple Earl Grey. But you this one. Mercy Millie Millie voice. I definitely bought you that. I think this is a floral one though. I remember correctly because I had that before. This is a bunch of kanji. <laughs> let's look at let's look it up so I at least know what the name is. Let's see. Oh, okay. I should have known this one probably. Uh yep, I should have recognized this kanji. It says it is the golden osmanthus. I don't know if I butchered that, but 
ですね。あ、uh, let me see now. If I can figure this out, this is a bunch of kanji I don't recognize. Yutaka midori. Okay. Yutaka midori. Well, let me see. What exactly though? Hey, where are you? Yutaka. Oh, okay, it's right there. Oh, so this is the sencha chiran. How the heck is that sencha chiran? I don't. I don't even see the chiran in there. Well, apparently, this is supposed to be the Sencha Chiran, which is this. Alright. Well, that's it. <laughs> and this one is the Momo Vert. Yeah, this is the Momo Vert one. Yeah, and this big long one is the Matcha Black Soybean Rice Tea, which is. I'll just explain this one because you might be like, huh? What is that? Soybean and stuff? It's again matcha, which is a rice tea with the matcha blended with black beans to promote healthy living. So it does actually have, you know, like the chunks of the, the like the actual soybean, like the black soybean in there. And then it's a little bit powdery, a little bit in, in there because of the matcha part. It's a little bit. And there should be the rice. So there's actual rice in here. Hard to tell. But um, I'm squashing it and it's pretty bumpy. I've had this before, not that often though. But I do like again my tea though. Okay, yeah, so we do our math quickly. This should be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is the 15. Chain two. I'll stick this back in here because I need to take pictures and stuff. <laughs> yeah, so that is the 15 tea bag sets. So as I mentioned, if you want something a little bit bigger or a lot more variety of tea, then there is a bigger amount. Uh, I forgot how much it is, but there's definitely a bigger amount if you want more than this in like that kind of style where it's like the individuals. Which that, the packaging for that is also nice too though. Oh yeah. And that's it. The bag is in. So that is... I guess we'll call it like an anniversary haul. That is my anniversary haul for the channel. Which is all of the Sakura tea. Because it is great. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, so that is it for this haul. I hope you enjoyed that. This time I got to go into a little more detail if you're not really familiar with their Sakura teas or the teas in general from the PCO. And maybe if you're watching this within time, they may still have some of this stuff. So you can go grab it if you're interested. Because packaging, like packaging, look at the packaging. And of course, you know, it tastes good. <laughs> That's no mistake, it tastes good, but I mean, packaging. <laughs> but yeah, so again, everything, like all the information is in the description box below, the website and all that. Um, and uh, I don't know what to say, like happy, if I say like happy first anniversary, <laughs> I guess, uh, for the channel, and more hauls to come, I guess. Uh, so thank you for watching, do all of that YouTube thing that everybody tells you to do, the like, subscribe, and all that jazz, and maybe there'll be more of the PC hauls, you never know. We'll see, but um, yeah. Thank you to everybody who has like subscribed and watched uh, all the videos, the longer ones, the shorts and stuff. 
I thank you for watching because I appreciate that and I hope with this I'm able to share you know like all the things that you can get different things maybe some things you've never seen so yeah I don't know I'm just rambling because I'm not sure what to say because it's like it's a first anniversary <laughs> So actually, I stuck with it for long enough. It's just, you know, I had breaks, but that's okay. We all need breaks. So, anyway, thank you for watching. And I guess I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.